Dr. Norton was one of the rich old supporters of the college the narrator attended. He was the narrator's employer. The narrator drove him around and ran errands for him. Mr. Norton is a very self-centered man. He exploits the pain of Mr. Trueblood's story just to gain some pleasure and have fun. He even gave him a $100 bill to serve as payment for telling his story. Aside that, he believes that he has created a positive environment and future for not only the black students, but also the black people as a whole. He takes pleasure in listening to people tell their stories. While he was at the golden day, he paid rapt attention to the mental patient. He also stood up for the narrator when he was punished for how he was treated during the drive, even though it didn't have much effect. Although Mr. Norton is a generous and sincere person, he considers the narrator a tool to be used and not a person, and he's also a racist. Finally, when the narrator leaves Mr. Norton and goes to New York, he realizes that Mr. Norton was only a fixed system that the college put in place to make it look like they cared for the students. See you in the next class.